My name is Carmel McDonough and I'm type 1 diabetic. When I was first diagnosed with diabetes, it was completely foreign to me. I was in the hospital for a week and I was given two pens, one with the long acting insulin and one with the short acting insulin. And back then you would have had to take your short acting a half an hour before eating. The technology from 30 years ago to today has, it's life changing. When I went into my diabetes appointment, when I found out I was pregnant, I met with Professor Dunn and she said I would be a perfect candidate for the EXPECT trial. The care and attention I got from Fidelma and her team was absolutely extraordinary. I've been so lucky. Um, they were ringing me every week. I was giving them my sugar levels every week. They were making adjustments for me and making sure it all went well. There is a huge difference from managing your diabetes on a day-to-day -day basis when you're not pregnant and when you are pregnant. Like that, you're checking your sugar levels 15 times a day, you're counting your carbohydrates, you're weighing your food, um, you have to be meticulous with everything. Of course, you want to protect your baby and you want to do the best for your baby when you're pregnant and if you have high sugar levels, um, it's very, it's damaging to your child. So that's always in the back of your mind and, and thinking that you could, you could be hurting your baby by not having controlled sugar levels. It's tough going, but it's, it's rewarding. You know, you, you get this, this wonderful bundle of joy at the end of it. So it's, it's all worthwhile. I take about six to eight injections a day. I got the Dexcom G6 two years ago, and again, another transformation in technology and my life, because now I don't have to finger prick. I um, test my sugar levels every five minutes on my phone. Plans for the future is to make sure my family is happy and healthy. Hopefully get an Omnipod in the future um, that'll sync with my Dexcom G7 and it'll make diabetes even easier.